Good morning, babes. It's Carlisa Victoria. I'm back with another video. So my hair looks a bit wild. I um actually washed it last night. I tried my hardest to stay awake. <sighs> Excuse me. I tried my hardest to stay awake as long as I could so I could dry. But then I got tired and I just like slept like on my hands. Like kind of like this. So my hair could, uh, and my hair was facing upward so it could try to dry. Um, this morning time, my hair is dry now, but I'm just thinking like, okay, sis, so what are we about to do with it? Just look, it looks like a heap of, I don't know what, I have it pulled back in a pony. Um, I wanted to add oil to my hair, but the only oil I have right now is Wild Girl, which I know Wild Girl is so stinky, but I might get Wild Girl and put it in my hair. I'm so hungry right now. I need to eat. But I don't know what I'm going to eat. I'm probably going to get up and um, take a shower. I think I'm going to make a coffee, write out my goals and affirmations. It's like later in the day right now. It's probably like, um, it's probably a good 10 something, 11. Where's the other? Let's see, shall we? Yep, it's 10.51. I know this is pretty late. Like, I will, I've been up. I've been awake for some time. I've just been laying here. But then, also, I went to sleep super, super late last night. So, I um, woke up late, in a sense. So, I'm about to do my morning routine, shower, wash my face. My face is looking so much better. Like I told y'all, I haven't had any processed vegan food in almost a month, so it's probably been like a month now. So ever since I've been chilling on that, my face has been dramatically improving. Um, and I've been trying to lower my stress. Sometimes you can't really control that, but the way that I've been trying to combat stress is making sure that I sleep on time, you know, drinking my water, eating my veggies, stuff like that, and just meditating, you know, all of that stuff. So that's how I've been able to deal with that. But if you if you go to sleep at a reasonable time, you will find that it's gonna automatically help the stress levels, like automatically, because you'll feel rested. Also cleaning your physical environment. I told you guys, like, I've been cleaning my house. Oh. Uh, doing laundry putting away clothing just therapeutic you know just thinking wiping things down cleaning the bathroom things like that so I'm slowly starting to see my space get back organized the way that I like it and because of that I'm finding like right now I'm laying in the bed with clothes like on the other side of my bed is just clothes nothing but clothes on one side of the bed and yeah I have them sorted out in piles so I have my joggers, you know, my dresses and things like that. So remember, I did just do laundry. So I put away everything that needed to be hung up yesterday. And today I'm just going to start making sure that I reorganize putting up my winter wear. Even though it's summer, I still keep a couple sets out like um, hoodie sets, the short sets, because I could just be lounging around the house and I get cold fast. And I'll keep the AC on because I'm not going to want the AC off the whole time. So, your girl, your girl gets pretty, um, it gets real. You know when you can't stress what you can't control. You just look at everything like, okay, <laughs> not going to start my day off stressed. So, I'm about to listen to my motivation. Um and just kind of tidy up myself. I was thinking about taking myself out on a date, but then I realized it's July 4th and people could be already like out and about mingling and I just don't wanna be around people like that. So <clears throat> it's probably a no. I just need something, just me time. You know, I've been in a space where I've been needing a lot of Kaylee's Victoria time. Nothing else, nothing more, nothing less. Just simply me getting my life. So, 
I'll see you guys in a little bit once I actually wear a routine, get dressed, all that. I don't want to really film that routine. I just want to come back and check in with y'all once I've gotten through some stuff. Um, I'm trying to think. My body isn't ready for a workout, like a full workout yet. I keep trying, like I keep wanting to get on my cycle, my um, cycling bike, my stationary cycling bike. And every time I'm about to get on it, I'm like, my body just feels like not there. So I'm definitely going to start out with a nice stretch, maybe today or tomorrow. Stretch. I might stretch today, but don't work out. And then try to get back into the groove of things come tomorrow. Um, it's been raining a lot, so... I wouldn't put it past anything for it to rain again. So if anything, I'll try to get it indoor. But yeah, let me go ahead and go ahead and I'll see y'all in a bit. What's up, babes? It's Curly to Victoria. I'm back with another video. So I was supposed to vlog throughout the day, but I didn't. So I basically just had some um, coffee and I had a salad. I was really hungry. So I think the combination of a salad and coffee was really good i had the coffee first and then i finished off the coffee as i was eating my salad but now i'm not going to eat again i'm drinking water in a little bit i'm going to link up with one of my friends i'm so excited um and i'm going to have a green avocado smoothie because i know where we're going um they have that that place that has it so i'm gonna have that for dinner i don't think i'm gonna eat if i do eat again it's probably gonna be either another salad or something very light i'm not super super hungry um obviously because i'm full right now but today's just gonna be really a hydrating day of drinking water of literally having my um green smoothie detoxification day um excuse me so that's what that's going to be i weighed in at 154 this morning yesterday i was 153 but i honestly feel like i'm probably backed up a little bit i haven't taken my probiotics i haven't taken my hair skin and nail vitamins and i haven't drank enough water so that could be the key too that could be the key too okay hey y'all so i'm literally leaving from hanging out with my friends and i had an amazing time so i not gonna prop the camera up because obviously if i could be quite frank y'all it's gonna fall like i'm on the interstate and it just keeps shuffling i think that's a police officer i need to slow it down because i don't have time to be getting pulled over they are already looking for people on the fourth um but anyway i literally just had yeah the way he's speeding he might be a cop let me see if this is a regular car or a cop I don't know the way he's driving. I'm not too sure. I'm gonna get over because I ain't got time. Um, no, I'm gonna let him go around me because I'm not making adjustments. But anyway, um, I guess that'll help me determine if it's a cop or not if he goes around.
coffee earlier that's still probably not enough food for the day so I'm trying to think what am I going to eat as my final meal am I going to eat at all um oh there is a spot that I like to go to but I don't know if that's what I want tonight to get that uh curry they have like some really good jasmine rice and curry but I'm not too sure I want that tonight especially with traffic so I gotta see is a police officer because that car is now that car is following me again and he's driving fast I think it's a police officer because they're driving like it's starting to make me feel uncomfortable because they were going one way and now they're going the exact same way as me and they've been following me I need to exit off this interstate because I'm not feeling comfortable we live in a crazy world y'all like we just really live in a crazy world um and you have to be vigilant you have to watch i don't know if they're drunk because he just drove crooked i don't know it's something off about that car oh he's trying to race me it's not gonna happen buddy i don't need to take it on july 4th but anyway um as long as he passed me so yeah, sometimes you just got to get around people who, you know, are good spirited and people who you can literally catch a vibe with. Um, so that's what I did today. And I'm so excited that we hung out like more than I thought that I would be. Um, not to say that I wasn't going to be excited, but like more than because it just lifted my spirit. Um, so yeah. end up being like another salad on bread basically or if I'm gonna go with a thing of tacos the veggie sub kind of sounds a little bit more um sounds a little bit more like will be up my alley at this moment because I can literally get like basically a salad on the sub again and, and get the salad dressing because where I go where they make my sub it'd be so good so doing all that speed and just to have to y'all people be seeing my car and literally be trying to race me and I don't even be trying to race them that be the that really be the plot twist like I'm not even trying to race you I don't even see you as far as I'm concerned so he about to blow out his back tires like I tell you these little tourists get here and they start acting dumb get here and they start acting dumb he really think i'm racing him his little car is about to like oh there's a police officer let me slow slow it down i had to put the camera down because you know if the police officers see you with the camera they magically are going to want to start to try to stop you they be out here like literally the cops out here they just they, I don't know, y'all, they be profiling literally, I get profiled so much I'll get stopped and they don't even know why they stopped me one cop stopped me and said oh, it's because, you know you're, you were speeding, I said no, I'm not speeding I come this way all the time, so I was very aware of the speed limit, then he goes, oh, well it's because you were changing lanes, I'm like, so which is it because I don't think either, he's like, well I'm just going to give you a warning, I'm like, man, let me warn you Okay, y'all, so I stopped by, got me a sub. So I got me a drink from the gas station. I gassed up. Um, I'm about to go home. People are asking, like, you know, what am I doing for the fourth? The question is, what is the fourth doing for me? The answer, nothing. So I'm going home. I'm about to work on some business. Um, I got some things that I need to get done. Really, really take time into. I didn't know today was going to go the way that it went, but I think a lot of times, like, our best moments are the most spontaneous moments that we don't plan for. Um, so I didn't plan for what I have go what I have going on today. But I ended up um, just really having a really good time in what I was doing. So um, 
like I said, yeah, I'm about to head back home. I just got in the car, so let me put my seatbelt back on. Um, that way I don't have to hear the buzzer going off. But yeah, I picked up a drink. I picked up a veggie sub. So all I had today was, like I told you guys before, coffee, salad, green smoothie. Now I'm having a veggie sub. So that's what I'm going to be eating. Um, that's what I'm going to be consuming. Um, but yeah, so I keep feeling like today is Monday, but really it's Sunday, so it's not even all that like popping. Um, I mean, it's popping, but it's not popping. You feel me? So I'm gonna go home, do a little clean up, listen to a little YouTube. She almost hit my car, but I'm glad she didn't because we can't be fighting in traffic. That's just not what we're gonna do. Um, but I'm about to head home, like I said, get some work done. I'm about to literally go into like seclusion mode so I can get like a lot of work done. Um, right now, I feel like I've, you know, just got some things done around um, the house and I've gotten some things done today, but I still have to get back to that complete cleanup, that workout. So I washed my hair last night and when I um, washed my hair, I literally feel like a whole different person because my hair feels so clean. Um, so I did that last night. And then now, when I get to the, the house, the real focus is going to be setting the goals, manifesting, all of that stuff that I need to do. I'm not going to hold you. I um, wrote out my goals the other day, but I have not been able to find my journal for manifesting. And I'm like, the devil's not about to get into this. <laughs> not into this. So I literally have to find my journal for my manifesting uh, affirmations. I don't know where I just put it, but we're going to find that tonight because we need to write out some stuff. Okay. Um, I just feel like if I don't write out my goals and my affirmations, I feel like I'm literally not, I feel like I'm not tackling what I need to tackle. And it just feels like it's missing as a part of my routine because I like to do that first thing in the morning when I'm getting things done. But considering I couldn't even find it, that's what just was making it like, you know, um, well, what's really going on? So I'm going to have to find that when I get to the house. Um, and then once I get that like done, written out and stuff like that, I think I'll feel better for the upcoming week. Tomorrow's Monday. So you guys know we're going into another full week. I don't see myself leaving the house at all for the day. So like at all again today, like, so I'm just going to take it home. I'm going to get some things done. Like I said, um, I really do have a lot on my plate, but I'm still trying to get the things done that I know that I need to get done um, in the order of priority. Like, I feel like everything I need to get done is a priority, but at the same time, you also have priorities within priorities. So some stuff is like, okay, I know I need to get this done, but they'd be like, I don't have to get it done um, right now. You feel me? So that's literally how I'm feeling, um, but I will get to it got to get to it to get through it so yeah so I guess I'll work on that stuff a lot of people don't know that you can make a right turn on red and it bothers me like it really bothers me like what were y'all doing when y'all was in driver's ed um so I'm basically like I said gonna just differentiate what's important versus what's not as important and that's what we're gonna do so that's what I'm gonna do that's what I'm going to boo boo. So that's where I'm headed to go get my ish together. I need to take a shower because I feel like I have all of today's germs on me and I don't want that. Sync has connected your phone and is reminding you that 911 assist is set to off. Sorry, the camera dropped. Um, but yeah, so that's what I'm about to do, y'all. So I'm just going to get off of the camera. I'm going to close out the vlog. I know I didn't talk about much. I didn't do much today. But this, I feel like, is at least about a 10-minute vlog. So I'll see y'all in the next video. Thanks for tuning in. Like, comment, share, subscribe.